clients. Uh, today, uh, let's see how to uh, uh, get some JSON responses. So JSON responses is very important. We will need it uh, to create uh, API, web service API. So it's very important topic for this. I uh, I create uh, one dedicated video for it. So to to create a JSON response, as usual, we use this route class. So we get the response so here uh, as uri let's uh, call it uh, json for example uh, in the anonymous function uh, we'll uh, we will use the uh, return uh, response response object this response object has a function called uh, json this json function will uh, get uh, as a parameter uh, our uh, posts variable so to remember just to remember this posts variable uh, it is uh, our variable here uh, holding uh, all our uh, posts here our posts is in, in form of uh, array uh, each array index uh, holding uh, a specific post okay so uh, we, we need these posts uh, uh, in use uh, inside our use uh, statement in order to use it because it's uh, declared uh, and defined outside of our anonymous function so we will use the we use we use this uh, use the statement to pass uh, the posts variable uh, array inside our uh, anonymous uh, function okay so let's name it this uh, route uh, json Okay. Let's test the save and test now. Okay. Let's type in JSON. Uh, response to undefined uh, class function I think have problem with this uh, response ah response this in French response so in English uh, response response let's save and that's it uh, we get our our uh, JSON response here let's uh, check it uh, with the uh, postman let's open it this is postman just uh, we copy our uh, uh, url this url for uh, json response okay we paste the url with the get just send and here we are we get our response here as you can see uh, so I hope this video uh, help you to understand how to get JSON response in Laravel. If you like the video, please like, subscribe and share. Bye. Ciao.